as we got a crazy race yesterday in the Elite One division. We were able to start the second race featuring uh, Frederic Gabillon, Alonde, uh, Borgio Garcia, and Stines Langen. And we are ready to start. And it's a great start for the French driver Frederic Gabillon from RDV Competition Team. We are on board with uh, Anthony Coupen, the Belgian driver. Borja Garcia is in the second place, followed by Alonde. Borja Garcia is just behind uh, Frederic Gabillon, while Anthony Coupen is trying as hard as he can to overtake a maximum driver to try to score some points. The fight for the fourth place is very hard with uh, Stines Longin. Oh, okay, get a small contact, he's spinning around and finishing in the gravel section who forced the, the safety car to go out. And we are ready for a new start in the Elite One Division Race 2 featuring uh, Frederic Gabillon and Borja Garcia. They are ready to rock the track here in Valencia. And here we go! With a great start for the both driver. In the Challenger Trophy, Jerry DeVert from Brax Racing take the third, while Marconi Abreu from Brazil take uh, the second place. And the win goes to Patrick Simon with the number uh, 70. Back with Anthony Cooper, who is now fighting with Patrick Simon to try to overtake him. Oh, in the inside, a great overtake by uh, Anthony Kumpen, the double uh, European champion who now has to fight uh, with uh, Freddy Nurstrom from Sweden then he succeeds to overtake him and uh, against Fernando Thomas, the French driver as well Anthony Kumpen has done a real great job on the track yeah. in the junior trophy the third place goes to Wilfried Busena while the second goes to the French driver Thomas Ferrando and the winner of the Juno Cup is Salvador Tineo Arroyo from Cal Racing. And back to the lead of the race where Borja Garcia succeeds to overtake Frederic uh, Gabillon, the French driver. Borja Garcia seems comfortable here at home as he's uh, leading the second race and succeed a second time in the same weekend here in Valencia on his own track as Frederic Gabillon finished on the second place and Alain Day on the third. Notice that Anthony Coupon finished on the fourth place starting from the last row. Amazing performance. Uh, Borja Garcia celebrating on the roof of his car, cheering his friends. Uh. Wow, really crazy, especially yesterday not, not more easy than today because I started in first ground, but today I started in third, in third position. It's a little bit complicated in this track to overtake, but really happy. It's amazing. It's a dream to win the, the two first sessions of the championship, pole position, also here in Valencia, in my hometown. It's unbelievable. It's the best start of the season that you can think about it. Yes, it's, a, it's, it's the best thing. I can do more. <laughs> it took a really great uh, great start after the safety and uh, my car was, was hard uh, during the first two laps, you know, it, uh, with uh, each team. So. After I was fast, huh? no problem, but uh, on uh, Bora too, so it was too hard to overtake him. And uh, no, it's a good result after the, the disappointing race of yesterday, so no, we're happy. But on the second part of the race, you seem to come closer and closer from Borja. Yes, that depends, you know, sometimes I'm close, sometimes uh, I lose time. Because it's really hard to make one lap with no little mistake, so that's the problem with this car. Uh, it's really hard to drive, so you have to be at 99% all the time, but uh, it's not possible. <laughs> Try it as hard as I can. There were two, uh, Gabion and, and Garcia were re really quick. I couldn't catch them. Um, we knew we had a fast car. The team did a great job. And uh, you can see that in qualifying, we had this car having the, the track record. Um, but probably the tires and everything. Uh, also the mess I had yesterday with, uh, with Garcia. Uh, I, could, I couldn't reach both of them. I will be better in, uh, in Brandstatch, that's for sure. And here is the podium with Borja Garcia celebrating his second victory this weekend in front of uh, Frederic Gabillon and Alain Day.